Hello and welcome to Ilana's Labs. Today, we're going to be showing you how you can use OpenCV to resize an image. The picture we'll be using is uh, something we can get from Unsplash, and it's a picture of these uh, ceramic cups. Uh, now, this picture is pretty big. It's uh, 5184 by 3456. And what I want to do is I want to scale this thing to something a lot smaller than this. So let's go to the Jupyter Notebook. Now I have downloaded this picture over here, so it's stored as ceramic cups in my local directory. Uh, let's kick this off by importing the required libraries. Next, let's uh, read in this picture. Uh, let's check out its shape just to confirm that it is the correct size. And then after that, let's display this picture within the Jupyter Notebook itself. Okay, so we can see over here the shape is 3456 by 5184. So 3456 is the number of rows, i.e. the height of the picture. And this is the number of columns i.e. The, uh, the, the width of the picture, and the tree represents the color channels. So uh, next, uh, let's actually resize this. Let's resize it to something that's 1,000 by 1,000, which uh, obviously isn't respecting the uh, aspect ratio of this picture, but let's start off with that. So what you're going to have to use is CV2's resize function, and if I hit Shift-Tab, you can see that what we can pass in is first the uh, the actual source, i.e. the picture we're going to put, and then the desired dimensions. So I'm going to create a new variable called resized. And let's pass in the picture. And let's say we want it to be a 1,000 by 1,000. And let's make sure the shape comes out well. Well, not just this variable over here. So we can see that its shape has actually changed. Uh, let's uh, let's take a look at this. Let's see what it looks like. Okay, so it has definitely changed the size of the picture. You can see uh, how these axes have changed, uh, but it is squashed in the horizontal sense. So if you want to uh, change the aspect ratio, if you want to maintain sorry, if you want to maintain the aspect ratio but reduce the size. Uh, what we need to do is we need to scale down the the width and the height of this thing in such a way that uh, it retain it retains that aspect ratio. Now the way we're going to do that is by uh, first we'll create a variable called scale. Now let's say I want to scale this thing down to ten percent of its original size. Uh, then after that we will calculate say a new width. Um, we can get the original width of this thing by going the original picture's shape and extracting the, uh, the width uh, element out of it. And then we can then multiply by the scale, after which we can do the same thing for the height. Now, it is important that you convert this thing into an integer so that we're dealing with whole numbers. And then after that, we are going to replace these hard-coded numbers with our new variables. All right, let's run this cells, well, these cells, and see what happens. All righty, so you can see that it has shrunk it whilst retaining its aspect ratio. So that is how you use uh, CV2's resize function in order to resize an image. Uh, that's the end of this video. If you got some good value out of this, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and I will see you on another video.